guys, Haley here. Today I decided to do a makeup tutorial video that I saw on YouTube. Is Rihanna doing her makeup <laughs> with Vogue magazine? And then I find it really really interesting that you know it's so hard to see um, some superstar sharing their makeup tips. And here is my attempt. Makeup's guide to love. Drama and summer. <laughs> the way she just spinning you know, is so back. cute. We're gonna start with foundation. So we're gonna, gonna start with foundation nice already. Okay, so she's just like doing a few pumps. Right now, I'm gonna use the Pro Future Soft Matte Longwear Foundation in one two zero. Oh. Shake well before I use. I'm gonna use this sponge. The precision sponge that comes in this very cute um, shape here It's so soft She did like a few pumps Okay, it's new so Okay, and then she applied it all over on her face Without concealer first And without like priming her skin first so Okay here goes nothing. My face look really bad right now because you know I <laughs> I slept at like 5 a.m. just now. Wow, the coverage of this foundation is really good. Okay, that's only half of my face. I can do my makeup in 10 minutes or 10 hours it feels like sometimes. It depends on what kind of day you're having and how much in a rush. It's true, it's true. Sometimes when you're in a rush, you can't do it in 10 minutes and you just feel very panicky. Oh my gosh, she's on the next step already. My next step is gonna be a little bit of contour. Mocha? A little bit of contour. contour. What? Yeah. She went straight into contour already? She is using the uh, Max Stitch. Max Match Stick. What? Matte skin stick. <gasps> Wait. Match stick. Matte skin stick. Um, in maple. <laughs> oh gosh. Like, I actually hardly do any contouring when I do my own makeup. Unless, you know, my face is really bloated. She blend out all these with a brush. This is the uh, foundation brush in 115. Looks like this. And yep, you're just gonna Some go. Fat days and your cheeks looking like baby cheeks. You just got it. Like, see that look? <laughs> baby cheeks. <laughs> I realize a lot of like um, Americans like to do very pigmented and you know very contourish makeup after Kim Kardashian came up with hers so everybody is kind of like you know I'm, I, I'm gonna try to do that but I feel for Asian face it's not so you know if you're into the Korean and Japanese kind of makeup looks they are always very subtle and very natural and very like you know not in the face kind of thing and because we don't have deep set eyes right so it's very hard for us to kind of replicate their style of makeup okay she's gonna warm up warm up the concealer like so and she just swipe swipe and then she used a very small sponge also from Fenty Beauty It's weird for me that I'm actually doing my concealer after foundation because I normally like to do my concealer first then my foundation and then do the powder um, yep I guess everybody, you know, even supposed to have their like, own habits of doing makeup, so it's cool. Mattifying this face a little bit because. I'm gonna mattify the face with powder, which I forgot to get. I'm just gonna use my own. And. This brush is really soft. And I like that it's a little bit angled. So. You can just get it like that. I'm gonna use the Sun Stalker. Is it Stalker? 
instant warmth bronzer is called the Inda Sun. Sun. Inda Sun. Inda Sun. I have never ever really tried using bronzers because I, I feel like for my skin tone it's very dark for me sometimes. So sometimes I, I guess I just. If I see tutorials like that, I guess I just use it for contouring purposes. Oh, she's using the same bronzer to warm up her eyes. Okay, I'm gonna use this brush that I have from It's Cosmetics. Heavenly Lux Shadow Brush. Looks like this. I love the handle, it's holographic. I just realized she has like, she already has her eyebrows done, so we probably should do this after. Okay, let's go. You have to practice on your own face because there are going to be things that you can do better than makeup artists. Like there's a certain point where they hand you something and you do it because there's there's one way that you like it and one way that it works. It's true, you're b the best teacher is yourself because you know your own features and although you have some habits and stuff but you're the only one that truly knows your own face. And that's very important for people to know because you know, the way that I do my makeup and when I share my makeup style or makeup habits on my IG or wherever else, my social media platform, it's, you you know, because you don't look like me and you don't do stuff like me. So it's just why you watch makeup tutorials to learn something new, right? Next is going to be a little bit of eyelid drama. Eyelid drama. Can we just draw our eyebrows first? Because I feel like it's not complete. <laughs> I'm gonna use the YSL one. This one is the Couture Brown Slim Eyebrow Pencil. I don't know what color is it, but yeah, this is the one. And then we're just gonna draw our brows first. I like to start off my brows at the end and work my way in. You really need to take your time while you're doing your brows because I mean, I love to take my time while doing my brows because this is the thing that frames your face. Sometimes makeup is just like painting, you know. <laughs> but your the canvas is your face. After that, I'll use the Kate Tokyo Designing Eyebrows palette. Like here, go over what I just did. Just kind of set it, you know, whenever you use them. I'm gonna use powder to set it so that it lasts longer. Yeah, I take the longest Beach, time on cleaning my brows. Bitch, please! Get it? Bitch, please! Okay, she's just gonna go straight into like her eyeshadow, right? Okay, I'm gonna use the Killer Watts foil. There's like Mimosa Sunrise for the orange color and the Sangria Sunset. Oh my god, my nails look the same color. Ooh, pigment. What brown is that? She didn't show. Um, Molly Cosmetics. Like an angled kind of brush. I'm just gonna use the Dior Backstage in Brow Palette 001 Light to do this. I'm gonna use the darkest sheet here and gonna do my lower lash. What? She went deep into the lash line. Okay, the same palette. She went in. More is more. Okay, then I'm gonna add another layer then. See? As soon as you smile, you know exactly where to put that. Okay. You definitely want to smile when you want to do your blush because that's how, you know, the apples of your cheeks. Okay, so basically she used this brush again to do the 
And then we're dipping into San Caso. And she went crazy on the highlight. Okay, I'm a little bit scared because I also don't do highlight normally. Whoa, check out that pit. Man, wow. This is really pretty. I can see myself using it more often in the future. This is tart sea glass. She did lashes. Let's go do lashes. I'm gonna use the Fenty Beauty. Fenty Beauty. Fenty Beauty. Full frontal. Volume lift and curl mascara. Cause I'm black. This is a huge bottle. It's like this size of my palm. Oh, this formula is really dry but dry in a good way because it doesn't clumps up my lashes and this is completely new right so normally it really clumps lashes on the first dip of the wand but this doesn't can you see the difference Okay, she just applied a lip gloss. Do I have something like that? Let me see. Okay, I have like two face one with me. Looks pretty similar. I'm gonna use this then. Sunset Crush High Shine Sparkling Lip Gloss from Too Faced. Super nice packaging. Okay. Hope it's similar. Ooh! So she didn't apply any lipstick, she just went straight into the lip gloss. I know why her eyes is like popping up so much right now because of her eye colour. And it really looks good with the purple eyeshadow. And she's doing the body lava kind of thing which I don't have. And I don't think we need it because it's gonna stain my shirt. <laughs> Okay, continue. Fast forward. And she's done! Okay! And we're done with the... <laughs> so erupt. That's because I fast forward. Okay. I guess this is the final look. Okay, let me know if you guys want to see my own style of makeup tutorial. And if yes, I'll do it for you guys. After sunscreen, you apply concealer, foundation, loose powder, Draw my brows and then um, blusher, eyeshadow, and then what else? Yeah, I don't really contour, so. Primer, no. No. Oh, primer depends on my day. If I like, I, I'm gonna hit up for a really, really long hours, I'm just. Then I will use primer. If I'm just gonna hit up for one, two hours, I don't really need to. I hope you guys enjoyed this look that I've created following Rihanna's epic 10 minutes guide to going out makeup. Um, yep, if you like it, please subscribe and leave me the comments down below on what I can improve on or what you want to see in the future. And do hit the notification bell button for me so whenever I have a new video coming out, you be the first to watch it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye! How long did you think you took for this 10 minutes epic? Oh my god, totally not 10 minutes because I have to like watch and pause at the same time. So how is that 10 minutes? It's definitely more than that. Probably like half an hour to like 45 minutes. Yeah, you're right. It's 45. Oh my god, that's 45 minutes past. Because my lips got basically got no colored, no colors, no colors. <laughs> 没有睡觉真的是不行哎，我天啊，我连讲话都不可以讲了，怎么办？ Okay, 重来。